Hey gang, check it out. This is a new, not yet released, Topton Professional Battery Tester and Charging System Analysis Tool. Uh, you can see right here, BT600 User Manual Battery Tester. It does all kinds of things that the little Topton does. Um, you guys know that I like Topton really well. Their quality is just exemplary. And this is no exception. I've been using the tar out of this thing for the last month. And uh, I'll show you what's really nice about it here. Um, but one, when you plug in your cables, they are secured by screws. With, uh, was that a VGA input or something to that effect? I don't not really up on computer terminology. The only drawback is the mini USB. I did mention, uh, they asked me to review it, and I did mention to them that they need to upgrade that to, at the bare minimum, the micro USB, preferably the USB-C, because this is updatable. Um, software updates can be programmed into it very nice clips very nice clips um, and they are wired on both pads so if only one has a good connection to the battery it's still good and it doesn't matter which one okay nice strong springs nice robust long cord nice long cord let's bring a battery into this picture go ahead and pop i'm going to screw these down Move this aside for just a minute. We're just going to do a battery test right now real quick. Uh, like I said, this has not been released yet. Um, I'm in the test bed population, so they sent it to me. Negative, positive, and then you get your screen. Very nice, very large screen, very easy. And goes right to the main menu. And you have uh, your directions here. You have battery test, cranking test, charging test. You review data. It will store the last battery um, tested. So I'm going to hit enter, review data. And that is the last battery that I tested. And that was actually out on that skag. So at that point, if I decide I want to, I can hit the enter again. And I get a customer printout. And you can see right here, this is the serial number. I have <laughs> I have tested 51 batteries in the last six weeks. So yeah, busy, 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 busy here. So now we're going to come down, scroll down to exit. Whoops. One. All right, it's just got the one. Uh, exit. There we go. Now, we're going to go back up to battery test, because that's all we're doing right here. This is a 2018 battery. Uh, it is an Exide Technologies, and it is the 360 cold cranking amp. So, we're going to hit enter. Regular flooded, yes. Cold cranking amp, yes. And here are all of the different types of uh, methods of charging across the world. So... It's uh, an all-inclusive unit. I'm going to hit enter. Cold cranking amps. 230. We have to jump up to 360. And it goes quick. A lot quicker than the other one. 360. Then hit enter again. Replace. 68%. But state of charge is 100%. And it's 296 cold cranking amps. So... Even though it's at 68%, this is not a battery I would sell. Um, this is a battery that I would use in the shop for testing other various things. So, that I'm aware of that, I'm going to go ahead and hit print. <clears throat> and it tells me right there, very first word at the top, replace. Uh, charge is 100%, still putting out 296 gold cranking amps. That's great, and it's still at 68% health, even though it's saying to replace. So, 68% is a whole lot better than no percents. But, 
there you have it. That's just a quick little introduction to the Topton. Um, we can, at some point in time, go ahead and um, do the charging test and do the start test. Uh, and we will also, um, I'll keep you guys posted on when this product becomes available. Uh, you saw it has the printer. You just lift this tab right here, okay? Flip that down and just drop the old roll out. When you get down to nothing but the plastic core, just drop it out of there. The only thing that's important is what direction that paper is, okay? Just make sure the paper's just like that and hold on to the top of the paper. Just set it down into place. Pull that paper up and over the little cutter bar, which is right here. Push down and lock. And then you can even pull up on it a little bit if you want to. Tear it off. And it's ready to print. And you're wondering, well, how do I get replacement rolls? Well, they've got you covered for a good long while just in the initial unit with two extra rolls. And I'm sure that you will be able to purchase those rolls. And I do believe they are also the same rolls of paper that are used on the previous models of the uh, professional battery testers. I do not have a price point. I do not have a discount code. I do not have a link because these are not available yet. But I will post a link to Top Den's Amazon store so you guys can check out some of the other things that they have there. And just a reminder that uh, we also have this little beauty right here. This is the Top Ten Tornado 4000. And we did a test on this one some time back and put it on a dead, dead, dead battery that was reading zero across the board. Zero, that it had nothing. The only thing it showed was 12.4 volts. <clears throat> but it had zero cranking amps and zero battery health. We put this thing on repair using this Topman Tornado 4000. And we got, uh, what was it? I think 46% recovery of the battery. So, very, very good product right there. Very good product. In fact, I've got other reconditioning chargers. This is my go-to. This is going back and forth between the house and garage all the time. Um, <clears throat> I may just go ahead and pick up a second one so that I've got it. Uh, but there you go. Oh, and I don't think I mentioned this the last time, but it does have these four spots here where you can actually uh, screw it in to the wall. Like if you had something like a charging station, battery charge, which I really should have, then you could permanently mount that and then have your cables at the ready to uh, go through and do the charging. So... Anyway, there's the Top Ten Tornado 4000, and here is the uh, Top Ten. Shame on my brain. Where did it go? 600. BT 600. Where'd the owner's manual go? <laughs> Where'd the owner's manual go? I lost. There it is. Okay. And it's a very good manual. Uh, reads out very well. Uh, really good instructions. So that, that's it. That's it. That's all I got. I was just wanting to show this to you guys. Uh, should be coming out soon. As soon as all the rest of the uh, uh, people on the list to review new products has gotten theirs. Um, and my representative uh, said... Go ahead and post a video about it. Just let them know that it's not available yet and just give them a link to our store. So, here you go. This will be a reality. The Topton BT600 will be a reality. Very, very nice. This is rubber over mold here. All the gray. And then a nice hard plastic. Um, so, I'm sure it would take a good drop as well. All right. Cutting it off before 10 minutes. Friendly neighborhood zip. I promise you guys I'll see you when I see you.